Let's bring in um, let's bring in Tom Lee uh, right now. Um, you know, we've had him on a few times since the bottom. He called the big move in the market. You all know that. And Tom, I gave you uh, a, a lot of credit for that for, for the for the gutsy call that, that you made. Now the work gets even harder, though, um, because we've had this big move, and there are some who are reassessing these. Let's let's just take not even focus on the epicenter stocks for now. Let's focus on these high growth tech stocks and these names like Amazon. The Nasdaq pushed past 10,000 again today. There are many stocks, including Amazon, which had hit new all time highs. There's no froth in this. You don't think that's a sign of at all of froth? Um, I mean, I, I think a pullback uh, is always healthy because it lets people reassess. And I think the debate your panel had makes a lot of sense. But. I think something we all have to consider is the U.S. economy is going through a contraction that's worse than the Great Depression. I mean, something we'll never see again, hopefully in five lifetimes. I mean, it's this bad. And if companies don't die and if they manage to grow, these are incredibly strong businesses. So I would argue that on the same level of earnings, all these companies are worth a lot more money because they've proven that you can't kill them. I mean, that, you remember that the problem with the stock market since 2009 was equity risk premium has been elevated because people didn't trust companies and trust equities, but these companies produce good numbers. Now we put them through probably the biggest stress test in five lifetimes. And if they've survived, I think they deserve higher multiples. I think that's really what we're seeing right now. And you're talking about even the Facebooks and Apples and Amazons and, and Microsofts of the world? Mm -hmm. Yes, I mean, because these are essentially unkillable businesses. If you throw a contraction that has never happened in modern American economic history, right, this is a contraction that we'll never see, I mean, globally, and they manage to grow earnings or to prosper, those are incredibly strong businesses. I mean, I just think that that's what we have to keep in mind. I mean, this, the stock market might need to be revalued because these companies, which for the last 10 years, everyone kept saying 16 PE is the right PE for the market. If you can't kill them in a Great Depression, greater than Great Depression, I think they're worth a lot more money.